we're going to run Android apps on a Linux desktop using the R con runtime. This is the GitHub download page. Just download the file you need. It's going to be in a zip. You're going to then take that zip file and extract it. And we're going to open up Chrome and go to the extensions page. Select developer mode and load an unpackaged extension. We're going to use that install that we just downloaded. There's going to be some errors, but for the most part, it works without, regardless of the, those errors. And then after we have that installed, we're going to download an app, the Archon Packager to our Android device, and then switch over to that device to package our app. In this case, I'll be packaging Faith in Cloud. The packager is relatively simple to use. Just select the application you want from a list. And once you have that application selected, You can pick which running environment you want, cell phone or tablet, portrait or landscape. And I check off the check marks on this. I haven't really tried it without it, but it works with them. So no sense in breaking something that works. From there, just process it and push it over to a cloud storage or to your hard drive or your phone's drive, however you want to get it over back over to your computer. And once it's on there, we're going to switch back over to Chrome on the laptop. And from there, in the same way, we're going to add the unpackaged application and then we can click on the launch which will launch it into our desktop you can also check off whether or not you want to add it to your, de your desktop or your applications menu on the first load it's going to ask where to put the files that it creates and just like Safe in Cloud, we have a single window to house the app on the desktop. Now, Safe in Cloud in particular does not work with Dropbox or with Google because it's looking for Android specific calls. It does work, however, with Microsoft's OneDrive or SkyDrive by using the web login. And so for this particular workaround, that's the only way to sync apps. Once you get it done, you have a nice safe and cloud